Knocking out episode 12 also because I still have time. Oh, it's going to be one of these episodes. Okay, we're going to see all the hearts that are put on everybody's uh, desks. And we have to see everybody's flank. Hello, Daisy. You can all see my cutie mark, can't you? Oh, yes, we can see it just fine without the zoom up. Blank was blank. Aww, so Then one day, when I was about your age, I woke up to find that a cutie mark had appeared. You woke up to find it was appeared. Okay. But honestly, that's how every pony was wearing their mane back then. How old are you? And the you were in Rarity's class, remember? I bet Rarity didn't dress like that or do her hair like that. Yep. She was in school with Rarity. You know, nobody makes fun of her or wants her to be taken out of the episodes, but they want Derpy to be taken out of the episodes. You know what? Everyone's full of S blank blank blank. Okay, I get it. You want me to pay attention to you. I love that look in her eye. It's blank. Remind you, Penny Pony. And people making fun of the blank blanks, the blank flanks, or whatever. I see a castle in the distance. I wonder what it could be. I'm improving my singing voice because this song bothers me. So please enjoy and remember that friendship is magic for some reason. You know, we don't want to take her out of the episodes. Why do we want to take Derpy out of the episodes? You know, she's still going to be Derpy to us. Well, actually, I didn't see her very much in the future episodes. Maybe she was taken out. I don't know. Maybe we just got slipped by by somebody that said something. I also noticed that uh, little jig got taken out too. 
I guess it was offensive also. You know, people that get offended should remember we have a right of free speech. It's just not fair. And we can Don't say and do whatever we You'll want. As long as it's legal. Kitchenero. Kitchenero. Sounds like Spanish. Should we start speaking in Spanish? Hola, como esta? Ah. Yo no comprende español. Then I got a few words for you, man. Um. Emando Chuta. Emando Chuta. That is my favorite insult. That is my favorite curse word. Emando Chuta. Because it's not actually a curse word. It's something I took from Star Wars and made into a curse word. Ichuta. Ichuta. Emando Chuta. I'm sure somebody will get that reference. Like that apple went far. <coughs> you gotta be crazy to be Pinkie Pie too, and she's right behind you somewhere in that, uh... Oh, hey, look, it's Dr. Hooves. You know that's uh, Derpy's husband, right? See? He didn't discriminate. He loves her for being derpy. Because she's derpilicious. Wow, that almost sounded wrong. You would have a satisfied customer eating an apple on your flank for the rest of your life. <laughs> I love that reaction. Wow. Awesome reaction. <laughs> you know, she's got a speech impediment too. I am really, really sorry about that. She's new. Here. Take these. Or a no accent. And these. Hint, hint. You should have said, and Derpy this. doesn't have a speech impediment. Yeah, she has an accent. That is what we all say. Right. Sorry, little sis, but your apple selling days You know, Pinkie Pie should have already been out to dominate the episode by now. Home. Now. Hmm. hmm. Listen, sugar cube. I know Why do you keep calling people sugar cube? You just can't force it. Besides, Jesus. You're not that grown up just yet. Ain't there other fillers in your class without one? Well, Twist doesn't have hers yet. Oh, her name is Thank Twist. You and and she's got a lisp. Mm -hmm. Well, there you go. Bet you and Twist would have a great time. Today. Or an accent. Yeah, you're sure you don't want me to stick around until the end of the market? Hey, who's been using my racket? Yeah, I'm sure. You know, you're not quite in the racket yet for selling apples. Oh, what's up, Apple Blue? So I was thinking, maybe we could... Did her accent change? I don't have a cutie mark. You don't have a cutie mark. Well, um... Is it my cutie mark as well? I've always loved making my own savory sweets, but it took me some time to discover that it was my super special talent. You know, if you're going to give her sweet. that kind of accent, she needs its yeah. braces. Pretty. You know? Sweet. Hey, this doesn't mean we can't go to the cute Sinera together. You're still going to come to the party, aren't you? Of course she will. It's not like being the only pony there without a cutie mark will be like the most embarrassing thing ever. <laughs> wow, the faces they make these ponies make. <clears throat> You're not going to sing about it, are you? Let me 
do something about that. What's the matter, kid? There's a cute scenario this afternoon, and every pony in my class will be there, and they'll all have their cutie marks. And I want to get my cutie mark, but I'm no good at selling apples, but I really want to go to the party. But how can I go to the party if I don't have my cutie mark, which my big sister says I'm going to get eventually? Maybe you should be an auctioneer. No, you Which don't. Happen when you can make it happen. But Applejack says, "Hey, who are you gonna listen to, Applejack or the pony who was?" She made a derpy face. I always like flying. And nobody noticed that. It wasn't until my I am going to keep harping on y'all about this derpy thing, because I think y'all are full of s dash dash dash. So Imando Chorta, mother. You're the cause of all this madness. Uh, didn't get rid of all the lag. Sorry. Try my best. Now fall off. Ugh. You know, she actually turned out pretty good on karate. How can you mess up kite flying? Seriously. How can you mess that up? As long as you keep running in one direction, you should be fine. Oh yeah, something else I'm good at. Yeah. Maybe you, uh, maybe your cutie mark will be Rainbow Dash crashing. Your new outfit is like perfect for the party. I know. It's like perfect. It's totally awesome. I think I'm blah blah. Crappiness. It makes me Try sick. There's Pinkie Pie. Oh, that's actually the best I'm sorry for blowing you off uh, speech I've ever heard. I didn't think of this. A cupcake getting cutie mark. It's so obvious. Now, yeah, diabetes as a child is awesome. Oh. No, it's not. You look like you'd be good at helping me make some. I guess uh, making cupcakes cutie mark could work too. Don't, don't sing. Don't. <sighs> yeah, remember not sour, no worms. Um, uh, no soda, no potato chips. <sighs> How many pinky pies are there? One pinky pie. Ah, ah, ah. Girl, Pinky Bye. Ah, ah, ah. This is not Nightmare on Elm Street, or. It should be Nightmare on Pinky Row. Guess I'm not cut out to be a baker either. Well, I oh, go baker. cry about it. I don't have a blank, blank forever. Well, what about that? <sighs> what about what? Is there something on my flank? Is there. Is there. Is there. What the heck? Like the most major lag I've seen yet. A measuring cup? No. A mixing bowl? No. Are those cupcakes? A tower of cupcakes, maybe. Flower! It's flower! Yay! I guessed it! What game do you want to play next? Please say bingo. Please say bingo. Whoa. 
you play bingo, I officially will stop playing bingo now. No, thank you. Not that they don't look. Why do they put hearts on everything? Jeez. Jeez. You should really be an auctioneer if you can talk this fast. I wonder how you would sound sped up a little bit more. How can I help you? You can use your magic to make that cutie mark appear. Oh no, Apple Bloom. A cutie mark is something that a pony has to discover for herself. Please, Twilight, just try. I'm sorry. I, I'm, please, please, I'm, please, please, I'm, I'm, oh, I'm, 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 like, thank you, um, thank you. uh, Well, that's what it could have been. Sorry, sweetie, but I told you. Pushing a cart right full of apples. Nope. Your name is Apple Bloom. It's most likely going to be a flower. And you're not going to be good at football, but definitely not. Make a cutie mark up here before it's time. It's hopeless. Hopeless. I just won't go to the park. I can't go. Everyone will uh, You sound like so many kids I've we'll be met before. I'm sure it won't be as bad as all that. Forget it. There's no way I'm going to that. Oh, it was right here. <laughs> Didn't you know they throw parties in uh, Pinkie Pie's house? Actually, you know what? If she works there, is that also her house? Where is her house? Does she live on the street? Is she homeless? Like somebody we're going to meet really soon? There's snails. You sound like Gilda. His cutie mark was a uh, clothespin. How does that work? He's good at popping things, I guess. Uh, Scooby Doo reference. Awesome. Why are you here? I was afraid you wouldn't show up. Sure am glad you came to your senses about this whole cutie mark thing. These things happen when these things are supposed to happen. Trying to rush it will just drive you crazy. I'll let you be. Looks like your friends want to talk to you. Those are not her friends. Hey, guess who I saw in the background? They already put her in the background. Do you know who it was? Can you guess who it was? She had a horn. She had a horn. You gotta watch my, uh, you gotta watch my, um, derpy commentary. You gotta watch it, man, or else you won't know who it was. Come on, man. You gotta watch it. You've got to watch it. This is officially the best day of my life, right now, knowing that that character actually exists. Maybe you'll be good at lying. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, wow. See, there she is again. There she is again, right be behind Apple Bloom's head. Come on, there is no way you didn't recognize that hairstyle. There is no way in the world. Oh, it's Scootaloo and uh, Sweetie Belle. No, it means she's full of potential. It means she could be great at anything. The 
possibilities are like endless. By the way, Scootaloo doesn't, doesn't have parents, Marcus, apparently. There she is again! I am so happy I'm gonna cry. I am so happy I'm gonna cry. I will tell you at the end who it was. But you've got to have seen that hairstyle. Come on, you've got to recognize it. Great, we're going to make the Cutie Mark Crusaders now. There she is again! They still get to experience the thrill That's of discovery. awesome! And what they're meant to be. It's awesome that and that character even exists. Oh, my God. Thank you, Hasbro. I officially like you. I officially like you now. I will not say bad things about you anymore. As long as season four has what I wanted to have in it. Derpies. Daughter. Derpy's daughter. Derpy's daughter. You see her? You see her? I know you saw that hairstyle, man. That hairstyle is unmistakable. That makes me happy. Very happy. There she is again. Very happy. I am very happy tonight. I am extremely happy. You have no idea how happy I am. We don't have cutie marks, diamond tiara, and silver spoon drive us. And I am still not a bony. <laughs> Just well, shut up. What if the three of us work together to find shut out up. who we are and what we're supposed to be? Ooh, ooh, we could form our own secret society. This was all Rainbow Dash's fault for putting in her head to get it to Try to find out what she's good at as quick as she can. This is worse than putting a gun in a child's hand and saying, "Pull the tr it, go play with your friends." Trust me. Princess Celestia. I learned I today that Derpy is actually going to have a daughter. And that makes me very happy. Because I see her in the background again. Hey, there's actually Derpy! Ow! 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 Derpy was at the party with her daughter! Awesome! Yay! Thank you, Hasbro. Thank you, Hasbro. Thank you, Hasbro. Thank you, Hasbro. Thank you very much. You have made me very happy tonight. Knowing that Derpy's daughter actually exists in the actual episode. Yay! And this is officially happily owned by Hasbro. Great job!